Hi, this is Kat Reinert and this is 5 Minute Mondays where I'm talking about a certain topic for five minutes. I'm a singer-songwriter, musician, and entrepreneur living in New York City and today's topic is about time and time off. And I think as creatives we tend to not do a very good job at taking time off. Uh, recently I've had some conversations with friends and colleagues about time off and we feel we can't take it. We feel we don't have the time to take it. We feel that if we take it we're being lazy. Um, and then on the flip side I've been reading a lot of books by business people and entrepreneurs and every single one of them says make sure to take time off uh, so that you don't get burnout and make sure to take time off before you get burned out. Um, so I think a lot of creatives fall into a space of we work really hard but we work from home. So we, society tends to think of it like, oh well you're not doing any work because you don't have a job. Well I have a job and my job is being an artist and being a musician and being an educator and all of those things take a lot of time to do really well. So for example, my day starts out at about 6 a.m. when I get up and I work out and then I eat breakfast and then I practice for as much time as I have that day. Usually these days it's about three to five hours um, and that's awesome. And then I take a break and then the rest of my day is spent trying to figure out how to get content like this out into the world, how to email gigs and gig opportunities to research uh, different kinds of venues to play at, to research festivals, to put together packages, to work on my website, to work on the social media kit, to figure out ways to make that work easier to read, uh, to maybe write. I also do a lot of uh, academic writing and so there's a lot of research that needs to go into that so I need time to do that. I also need time to think. Um, I have a husband so I need time to spend with him. And I think all of these things, no matter what your puzzle looks like in terms of putting together work and a job, it it can be very overwhelming to the point where it feels like you're not getting anywhere. Um, and I recently left an academic job where, and so this is very loud in that like, when it came to Saturday, it was my day off. And I had time to do shopping and laundry and, and to work on some other things. But because my job entailed, you know, it, it gave me a structure. Whereas as creatives, we have to kind of make that structure. And it can feel like when you take time off, that you're not doing enough, that you're you're not pushing hard enough, and you see all these people and they're doing amazing things, and you're like, I want to do that. Um, and so it can get very debilitating, and to the point where we stop being creative because we're so overwhelmed that our brains don't have time to process the creative stuff. And this is also something I've read a fair amount about, which is the creativity, like thing needs us, needs time off. It needs time and space and space to think. So, you know, it, and that could be, it can be little things, it can be big things. Um, it can be meditation for five minutes in the morning. It can be taking a walk. A break can be lighting a candle and just sitting still for 10 minutes. It could be coloring in adult coloring books or, um, or kids books if those are more fun. Uh, it doesn't really matter, it's just the act of kind of sitting there filling in lines. Um, it could be having a coffee with a friend, it could be meeting someone for a drink, it could be, if you're old enough, uh, it could be you know calling a friend on the phone or talking to someone on FaceTime, it could be scrolling through fun Pinterest apps. It doesn't really matter what that space is, but it's important that you give it to yourself. Because if we don't, then as creatives, we forget why we're creating. I think we, we also, there's a this beautiful quote by Ron Miller, who was a professor at the University of Miami for a long time. And one of the things, I, I still remember this, it was in my office um, on a poster. And it said, take time off because you have to have something to bring to your creativity. So if we never stop working, we never bring new things to what we have to offer to the world, and we have a lot to offer. 
So for anyone out there struggling with this, you know, send me an email, like send me a note. I'd love to hear from you. I think the more we talk about it, the more it normalizes and the easier it gets for us to figure out how to deal with this. Good luck. Have a great day. Bye.